Hi everybody, today I'm going to do a small video on how to optimize your mouse when you're playing video games. Um, the one thing that you really need to know is when you uh, install your Windows, by default you have acceleration in your mouse. So what the acceleration do, um, for example, if you push your mouse very fast, normally your cursor will go uh, faster because of the acceleration. Same thing if you go a little bit slowly, uh, you will have some deceleration in your mouse pointer and you will feel it. This type of behavior, you don't want that when you're playing a first person shooter because you want const you want to your mouse to be constant when you move. So the first thing that you really need to do, uh, whatever mouse that you are using, gaming mouse or just a normal mouse without any driver, you need to remove this acceleration. To do that, just write mouse in the setting, click mouse setting. After, go, after that, go to additional mouse option, click on it, go to the pointer option over there and make sure the ancient pointer position is unchecked. Really important to do that. Press OK and it will save. So now you just remove the acceleration from your mouse. Depending on the brand that you will use, sometimes in the driver, you can do it uh, straight up in your driver. So uh, depending on the software that you will use, but you can do it directly on Windows. Second thing that is really important, download the software that come with your mouse. So depending on your mouse, if it's a Cooler Master, Logitech, Razer, whatever, sometimes you have a firmware, uh, the firmware will improve your mouse, the sensor, sometimes you can have like a small bug with your sensor. Make sure that you have the latest version of, of your mouse. This is really important. The third thing that I recommend is the sensitivity. Uh, a lot of people is asking me questions about sensitivity, like I'm playing Fortnite, I'm playing a first person, what should I do? The only thing I can really tell you is lower normally is better, but everyone is different, so this is pretty much you have to find it. A good base, honestly, it's 800 normally. Uh, start with 800 and look at it, like uh, play some games, record yourself. If you see that you go too far when you try to shoot someone, probably because your uh, DPI is too high. And if you feel that you're a little bit short when you try to kill someone, uh, maybe you need a little bit more DPI. Um, honestly, you should just like use one DPI over there and after that change the sensitivity in your game. So honestly, a, a good base is 800. Do your 800 and after that, just change your uh, sensitivity inside of the game and normally everything will uh, go fine. If you like, if you are a low uh, sense guy for sure, like a lot of pro CS players are playing at 400, so it's really depend on uh, what do you need, but normally a normal gamer, a typical gamer, I feel like 800 is a good base to start. One more thing that you need to look at is your polling rate. Uh, higher is better, so you can go with 1000, but honestly, you will not necessarily see the difference between 500 and 1000. Uh, for the past four years, pretty much all the gaming mouse uh, have 1000 now. So just like make sure that you're using it. But honestly, if you have 500, it's not a big deal. Uh, you will not see the difference. But it's a good thing that to look at because I don't know, sometime maybe randomly your default will be at 125. So make sure that you're using the higher version. So that pretty much it guys, if you have any question on your mouse, like make sure that you update your mouse, you download the latest driver, you remove the acceleration from it, and after that you really need to test it because uh, if you're playing Valorant, you probably want like a lower uh, sensitivity if you compare to a game like Warzone that everybody is going everywhere and it's really fast. So you will need to adapt your sensitivity inside of the game for sure because every game is different, but uh, yeah, just like do some testing, record yourself, and it will help you a lot. So that's about it. If you have any questions, just come in the YouTube section, post me uh, your mouse, uh, what type of mouse, the brand, the model that you have, and uh, I will try to help you the best that I can. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Peace, everyone.